Yeah, so I was exploring a cave in this Let's Play Interactive Minecraft, but I died. So that ended up being horrible, so I decided to restart this episode. Now, before I start doing anything, I have to reset my options, because I am now recording my voice through Fraps along with the game audio. Because I wanted, because there was a lot of lag in the sec this second episode when I first recorded it, which wasn't good. Let me change the difficulty here. So, yeah, that was bad. I'm changing these settings to 50% so that you could hear me better, hopefully. If this doesn't work, I'll change back on episode 3, but... Anyways, I just installed a mod to this, Optifog, I think? Either Optimine or Optifog to reduce lag, and the animations are a lot smoother, but I'm afraid that it still lags a bit. I haven't, yeah, it's still pretty freaking laggy. Alright, let me check my um, settings again. See, like, I get a whole bunch of more settings. Graphics fast. I have everything on fast, so. Load far on. Smooth FPS. So I, I don't I really don't know how to improve my FPS, so I'm sorry about that. Anyways, on this episode we will be exploring a dungeon. Now, this challenge was by my friend Spencer, aka Halo Rocks My Socks 47. And he's also on this channel as well. Um he told me to go look at all the grass, man. Yeah, it also gave me like HD water and trees and whatnot. So some things look a little bit pretty prettier. Anyways, he told me to only go to a cave with as much armor as... Oh shoot, didn't mean to do that. He said only 20 torches, so I'll just keep those there. And he says I could get as much armor as I want. This is all the armor I've got though. And as much food as I need so I got all that I went exploring to get some uh, food and stuff and look for armor to get I found some iron but it wasn't in a cave it was like outside of a cave so I was like okay I'll get that I also found a wolf while I was exploring but I could not tame it so that made me sad because I had no bones but anyways as you can see there's some random stones I've placed that will actually lead me to this one very particular place I found while exploring this little island. And yeah, it is still pretty freaking laggy. I, I really hope it doesn't end up looking laggy on the video. I might need to recheck that. Maybe it's just because I installed Optifog and it needs to load up still a bit. But anyways, yeah, I'm following these stones. And these stones will lead me to this very weird place I found. Now, I know dungeons are usually covered in moss cobblestone. But I found this very weird place. That I also marked with a giant stone pillar, so as soon as I find that, that'll be good. But, yeah. So when we get there, then I'll know I'm near this very weird place which had natural cobblestone, so that made me think that I found... Yeah, I saw it right over there through the fog. But anyways, you may have noticed I was in a different house. Yes, I built up a whole new house with a bed and everything. I haven't slept in the bed yet, so if I die, that's really gonna blow. Because I actually lost where I originally was. Um, I'd rather not talk about it. I was exploring and I just lost it. I found it again so I didn't build the house at first, but then I lost it again so I did. So yeah, here we go. This cobblestone is natural and I do hear spiders. Oh crap, there is moss cobblestone. I think I found a dungeon. So you know what that means? I don't think I need to explore very much because I already found a freaking dungeon. That's amazing. Oh man, it's actually... Whoa. That is... I didn't know that happens. <laughs> I'm going to place a torch here because I don't want these guys spawning all over me. 
Is this supposed to happen? I just found an under sand monster spawner. I do hear spiders, so I know there's gotta be... I don't know if that's just coming from the monster spawner itself or not. And I don't know if... I've never found a monster spawner out in the daylight, so I do not know if it's just gonna spawn in the daylight or if I have to wait till night before they come out. But I don't know, this is pretty cool. I knew there was something weird about here. I'm just gonna dig with my hand now. Don't feel like switching to my shovel all the time. Well, Spencer, there's your uh, monster spawn thing. He told me to keep digging in a cave until I found a monster spawner. But you know what? The first time I recorded this episode, I got lost. I, lo I lost a bunch of iron. So you know what? This counts as my exploration. So I'm sorry, Spencer, but oh well. Anyways, let's see what's in these treasure chests. I guess I have to get rid of all the sand on top first. Okay. Oh, there's cocoa beans. So I basically prepared for nothing. So that's awesome. There's a saddle. I am definitely going to tame a pig. And there's gunpowder. Bread. That is all good. By the way, we have a new subscriber. It's... Mile Esther, I don't remember his, like the numbers at the end of your name, but it's kind of weird saying your name. But anyways, he's been watching my I Wouldn't Be The Guy videos, he said they're awesome, and he went on my Interactive Minecraft Part 1, and he recommended me building an igloo. So, pretty soon I'll be building an igloo, as soon as I find snow and stuff. Can I put cocoa beans together? Yes, I can. So there's a bucket, another saddle. I really do not need sand. More beautiful gunpowder from me. And I cannot grow buckets, so I'll just get rid of this dirt. Probably should have just put it in there. But anyways, yeah. Here's a dungeon. Now, what I should probably do is I want to mine some of this mossy cobblestone. Because one of my other little things... Somebody wants me to do is Scott. He told me to build a shrine for his pet slime, so I'm going to be doing that. Hopefully my voice is coming up above all the audio. Did I even change the settings for the audio? Because I changed the music down to 50%. Yeah. Anyways, yes, this is a lagging a little bit, which is not good. But oh well, if it's laggy on the video, then you guys are just going to have to deal with it. Um, I guess I could just get rid of this shovel. Because it's basically done with. There we go. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get some of this mossy cobblestone for uh, Scott's Pet Slime's um little shrine of magic. I was going to put it here, but I did not expect... The monster spawner to be, you know, over... I didn't expect it to be out in the daylight like that. I know it was technically under sand, but you know what I mean? It's just kind of random how it's outside. Well, I'm really glad I found that, so that means no cave exploring for right now. Because, Spencer, you only told me to go until I find a dungeon, and this counts as a dungeon what I could tell. What I might do after this episode is I might... Whoa! Hello. Maybe there's another monster spawner somewhere nearby? I, I don't know. I might have to go explore anyways. Oh, hot sand. Get out my little shovel here. So yeah, anyways... So I'm going to be building an igloo in part 3 probably if I find snow anytime soon. How much mossy cobblestone do I have? 23, that is enough for me. Ha, buddy. Ha, buddy. Come on. Yes, this is a lot. This is very laggy. I don't know why it's doing this. I just installed Optifog. Hoping it would work, but... Holy crap! Holy crap! Oh god! Oh god! What is this? 
What is this? I'm just... I'm running. I'm running. Screw that. Screw that. That scared the crap out of me. Um... And now it's turning dark. Oh, joy. You know what? I'm not just gonna run away. I'm gonna ambush these guys. But holy balls. Look at all of them! Look at that! Holy cow! I don't know why I went high pitch for that. Meh! All of you die! Holy crap. I've never seen them pop up like- Oh! God! He's attacking me! Get your freaking sword out! Oh boy, I see you! Okay, maybe they spawn- I still hear another spider. Oh! Hi, Sand! So I'm guessing this monster spawner is where all the, those spiders came from, but I don't know how they got into there. Unless there's another spawner. I'm probably going to be exploring. Hey, buddy. Okay, do I hear any more spiders? No. Look at all this string. Holy crap. So, um... I'm gonna get rid of this sandstone because with all this string I could definitely make myself a lag I can make myself a good old bow and although I don't really like making arrows I would rather just steal them from skeletons but oh well oh crap oh crap no 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 the game is lagging! The game is lagging really badly. That is not good. Okay, so they still spawn. I don't know why they're spawning randomly in that cave. Oh wait, no. I do know because it's dark in there. Not, I don't know if it's because of this. I hear a freaking skeleton. No way. Um. What do I do? Oh, you know what? I have freaking food. What am I doing? Nom nom nom. I said nom. Oh, hi, dirt. Okay, that's all I really want. I'm really mad at how laggy this was because everybody was saying how Optifog was so amazing at making lag stop. Let me turn on smooth lighting. That might be because of it. Did it... Did it... Video freeze? Minecraft froze.